So today we're going to learn how to put a tyre on a tube. This applies to any bike. We've got the rim, we've got the tyre, we've got the tube. So what we've done is we've checked the tyre for, for a piece of wire or a piece of glass. We've turned it inside out and just running our hands gently around the tyre and you find a bit of glass, you pull it out, you put a patch over that if there's a big hole. So we're going to put the tyre on first. And what we do is we start at the brand when we put that on the eyelet. Because this is a unidirection tyre, it has the brand on both sides. If it's, if it's a directional tyre, directional tread, it will have the pattern only on the one side on the right. So we put that on the, near the valve. So then that, next time we get a flat tyre, we can easily find where the puncture was by checking the tyre first. So that goes on easy. And then we, then we put the tyre flat like that, like it's a, pe like it's a pizza. You just imagine you're spreading sauce on a pizza. We get our tube, we put a few strokes of air in there so it's circle, so it's round, and then we start. We're putting the valve in first, like so. Now you always check the rim tape. This, this rim doesn't have any rim tape, but if it has rim tape, you make sure the rim tape hasn't moved and it's exposed to spoke eyelet, and that can cause a flat tire. So we start with the valve, we put the tube in, and we Go around like so. We put the, the tube in first. So the tyre's on one side. Now we put the tube in. We start at the valve. And we put the tube in. And then we start at the valve again. And we put the second bead of tyre around. And notice my hands are going to come together. They're going to come together like catching a football, like catching a basketball. Never go like this. You always go like this. Hands coming together, chasing each other. Hands coming together, and look at that. That's so easy, pops on like that. That's just so easy. Hands always coming together. You'll see people going like this, and then the, the tire keeps popping off. Hands must come together. It's a thumb action. It's not strength, it's pure technique. I can get any tire on. No tire levers needed. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna go around, make sure the tire's not squashed between the rim and the tire bead. If it is, we, we just massage it and it will suck back under. Because if it gets caught in between, it can cause a pinch flat when you pump it up. They can burst your tube. They can burst your tube. We'll go to the other side. It takes a bit extra, extra 30 seconds, but it gives you a lot of safety. It gives you a lot of security on the downhills that your tire's not going to burst, or it's not going to burst the next five minutes. You have to fix it again. And sometimes the tube gets caught near the valve and doesn't bead properly, so we just push it up and just give it a jiggle. Never use force. Always use technique. Always use patience. And now it's ready to roll. Pump it up. We look on the side of the tyre, we'll have a rating, this one's 120 psi. We give it a press there in case it gets stuck. Just put it on here. And then we look at 120 psi on the, on the gauge, and we just pump it up. And then when we spin the tyre, we know it spins perfect because we took the time out to make sure the tube was seated properly and it wasn't stuck under the rim and the tie bead, and that's perfect. Um. This will make a good thumbnail. Oh, yeah. <laughs>